today we are going to talk about motorcycle gear and why are we going to talk about motorcycle gear we are going to talk about motorcycle gear is because the amount of times you see people riding motorcycles without the correct gear on now it doesn't matter if you're riding a 125 or a 50cc motorbike it doesn't matter what cc motorcycle you ride as a motorbike rider you need to be wearing the correct motorbike gear now the amount of times you see people riding in just a pair of trainers a pair of yugo boss jeans and a bloody stone island jumper listen it's dangerous it's very dangerous as a beginner the best advice anybody can give you is wear the correct gear if you are going to spend the money on a cbt insurance tax mot get the right correct gear now i know that might spoil your street cred and you might think oh i'm only riding a small cc i don't need no i don't need the correct gear now you do you need the correct gear because road rash will bloody hurt and it doesn't matter if you come off at 20 miles per hour the clothes that you are wearing you're not protected now I'm not telling you to go to your local motorbike shop and spend £400 on a pair of motorcycle leather bottoms. I'm not telling you to do that. What I'm saying to you is, is go and get a pair of padded bottoms and a padded coat. Now, I wear RST leather bottoms and I wear an RST textile coat. That's all I wear and then I've got jumpers on top of them. And I wear a pair of motorcycle boots to protect myself to the best I can because I like to make sure I'm going to go back home to my family at the end of the day again with an helmet you see many people just pass their CBT and they go and borrow their mate's helmet that's 10 years old now it, 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 the state helmets have a sell by date but the fact here is it's the fact that the helmet doesn't fit them correctly it's too big. If your helmet is too big and it doesn't fit snug how it's meant to, the impact, if you have a crash, your helmet is most likely going to fly off. And if your helmet flies off, again, your head isn't protected. So, go and get the right motorcycle gear if you are going to ride a motorbike because that's the best advice anybody who rides a motorbike can give another person who's just starting out on a motorbike or somebody who's been riding a long time and they think oh it's a lovely summer hot day i don't need protection no you do need protection because cars don't see us as motorcyclists as it is so get the right protection that you need for when you go out on your motorbike just so you can return back to your family at the end of the day that's what it's all about it's all about protecting yourself and that's what this video is about if i can help out a fellow rider then i will i'll help out as best as i possibly can and that's why i'm making these videos to help beginners out don't think just because oh i'm new to riding i've spent all this much money and i haven't got no more money left so i can't get the right gear so what i do is i'll just risk it in my yugo boss trainers and my stone island jeans listen you're not protected get protected 